fight, the fight You did it in a fight last time Motherfucker, you're addicted to your life You gotta fight Alright, coming up next is the UFC Heavyweight Showdown Every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal try and finish an opponent. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Anthony Joshua has arrived at the UFC doorstep this man has sold out arenas across Europe in front of 90,000 plus. You don't expect the magnitude of the moment to be too much for him, but will the mixed martial artist that he shares the octagon have too many skills? We'll find out here in a moment. Should be exciting. Kill the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Three years apart, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Dollar Bill. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 237 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, Anthony Joshua. All right, green through the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fight. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? All right, here we go. Round one, outstanding matchup of strikers. Any chance this thing hits the canvas? I don't believe so. I think when you have two high-level strikers like you have in these two men, they're going to go to the center of the octagon, and it's going to be a kickboxing match, a kickboxing match that you would see in a ring. Tonight, you get to watch it inside of an octagon. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Well, he's looking for that left hand just out of range, though, with it. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. On the side would be beautiful leg kick. A oh, little single collar tie there. Nice straight punch. Nice. Now he engages in a Muay Thai clinch. You better protect. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, straight right. Oh! 
And he landed the right hand there. He went high on that. Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Point time, Trump. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round. That is as big a strike as he has landed thus far. So big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Joshua's looking to pass into half guard here, but he's denied. Oh, back up again. You can't hold a good man down. Effective strike there by Josh. Goes to the body there. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. In this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliana has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 28 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Dollar Bill. And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoyed the birth of your kids, right? But yeah. you knock out